the spice is ready to flow again. After a successful bow in theaters and on HBO Max this past weekend, Denis Villeneuve's Psy, Phi Epic Dune is officially getting a sequel. On Tuesday, production company Legendary Entertainment announced the news of a part two, slated to open exclusively in theaters October 20, 2023. This is only the beginning, Villeneuve said in a statement. Dune stars Timothy Chalamet as Paul Atreides, a young man whose family is put in charge of the mining of a precious resource, the mind, altering spice, which also is the key to interstellar travel, on the desert planet Arrakis. Paul survives a vicious attack from rival House Harkonnen and allies himself with a Freeman, a people indigenous to Arrakis, and Chaney, Zendaya, a Freeman woman Paul's had visions of in his dreams. Review, Dennis, Villeneuve's Psy, Phi Epic is a mixed bag of eye, popping Psy, Phi, lackluster story still have questions after watching Dune. All your burning questions, answered Villeneuve's Dune adapts the first half of author Frank Herbert's influential Psy, Phi classic, while part two will continue the story. Unlike some other big, budget franchises, both films were not made at the same time and Warner Brothers and Legendary took a wait, and, see approach to green lighting a sequel. Villeneuve was at peace with this idea and knew it was a gamble. The director told USA Today prior to the film's release, I put all my love and my passion into this project. He knows exactly what to do for part two. It's all already in my mind, Villeneuve said, adding that comparatively, the first movie will look like an appetizer. I hope I won't have to use it. Timothy Chalamet learned this new skill from Dune Team Old Spice, David Lynch's 1984 Dune is more entertaining than the new. Psy. Phi Epic Dune had a $40.1 million opening weekend at the box office, even with audiences being able to also stream it at home, and so far the epics made more than $223 million worldwide. I know everybody is super hopeful and jazzed on the possibility, of a sequel, Chalamet told USA Today. I remember watching films growing up and already clamoring for more. Until now, he added, I've never had that feeling about something I'm in. Contributing, Brian Alexander, and Patrick Ryan.